This is definitely the most thrilling horror blockbuster of 2023. And another zombie movie from South Korea after Train to Busan, the story takes place in the capital of South Korea. Two idle men sneakily pry open a shipping container filled with a large amount of jewelry and gems. As they get excited about their discovery, a cat suddenly emerges from the container. Before Wang Nai can react, the cat pounces on him, leaving a scratch on his neck with its sharp claws. Initially, Wang Ai ignores the wound and continues to search through the box for gold watches. However, as the virus slowly spreads within Wang Ai's body, he starts losing his sanity. His companion tries to call Wang Ai to get on the car, but this only triggers his bloodthirsty nature. The next morning, Wang Ai wakes up by the Han River, now in a state of half-human, half-zombie, with what was left of his instincts. Wang Yi took one step at a time towards the center of Jiangnan, soon a man eating raw pork appeared on the busy streets, and this man was none other than the half-human, half-zombie Wang Yi. A crowd of onlookers takes out their phones to record the scene. Unaware of the impending danger, as more and more people gather, Wang Yi, frightened, breaks through the crowd and runs off. On the way, he meets a water delivery worker. Wang Ai follows the worker's truck to a building. After seizing the opportunity when the water delivery worker wasn't paying attention, Wang Ai suddenly bit into his neck from behind. <laughs> Having tasted human blood, Wang Ai was now fully transformed into a zombie. A horrifying massacre was about to begin, and the zombie virus quickly spread throughout the building. Those bitten by Wang Ai have turned into zombies. Madam On, who is collecting rent in the building, sees the scene and orders his security guards to stop it. But in the face of so many bloodthirsty and brutal zombies, the security guards were pressed to the ground by the zombies as soon as they entered. Seeing that the situation has gone out of control, Madamon directly called the security guards downstairs to close all the doors with his walkie-talkie. Madamon wants to seal off what's happening in the building. As soon as the security guard locked the doors downstairs, a horde of zombies appeared behind him. And before he could call out for help, the zombies had already pounced on him on the ground. On the other side, Madamon and the others are being chased by the zombies. As they pass by a short video office, they decide to hide inside. Hoon Ji was the owner of this office. As soon as came in, Madamon saw Wang Ai on the screen. Madamon was terrified and told everyone that this person was the one going on a rampage, biting people in the mall. While everyone was still trying to make sense of the situation, Hoon Ji, on the other hand, was unusually excited. This was the perfect opportunity for him to capture unique footage. Hoon Ji thinks that if he can film all the biting his monsters in the mall, it will be a sensation. Hoon Ji led everyone as they rushed out, unaware that the security guard who came in with Madamon had already been bitten by a zombie. The group carefully made their way through the stairwell to the floor infested with zombies. Outside, there are biting zombies everywhere. Seeing this, the group was utterly shocked. Hoon Ji took out his phone, ready to film, but suddenly, a zombie appeared right in front of him. <laughs> the screams attracted more zombies, and they started closing in on them. Luckily, Hyunsook kicked the zombie in front of him and closed the door just in time for the crowd to escape. They hurriedly ran upstairs. Min Jong wanted to use her phone to call for help, but Eun Ji was only concerned about capturing footage for his video. As they argued, the zombie Wang Ai appeared before them. Hyunsook rushed forward without thinking. <laughs> Although Hyun Sook had some martial arts training, his regular attacks were ineffective against the now zombie Wang Ai. Soon, Hyun Sook was thrown aside by Wang Ai. Then, Wang Ai lunged at Eun Ji and the others to save his own life. Eun Ji pushed one of his employees towards the zombie Wang Ai, sacrificing him to buy time for the rest to escape. They quickly ran back to the office. Sly Eun Ji continued to film through the glass window. Min Jong tried to call for help with her phone, but Madamon knocked it to the ground. Madamon didn't want the incident to be known to preserve the building's reputation. While Madamon complained, Hyun Sook and the others suddenly looked horrified. <laughs> Hyun Sook rushes up and fights with the zombie. But the zombie was like a dance master. 
with all sorts of difficult moves. While Hyunsook was fighting with the zombie, the zombie Wang Nai came again, fearful. Hoon Ji used Min Jong as a shield. <laughs> The building was now filled with zombies, searching every corner for prey. <laughs> Hyunsook led Min Jong into a warehouse to hide, realizing they couldn't stay hidden forever, they needed a way to escape. Hyunsook looked around and found a radio on a shelf, and he came up with a way to get out. Hyunsook first hung the radio in midair with a rope and then played a song. All the zombies were attracted to it and even the dead zombies got up from the ground. While most of the zombies are captivated by the music, Hyunsook pulls Min Jong and runs towards the office, but they don't get very far before they encounter a zombie. Hyunsook quickly got into a fight with the zombies. <laughs> Min Jong was about to help with a baseball bat when Unji, who had turned into a zombie, appeared behind her. Unji keeps touching Min Jong's arm. At that moment, Min Jong suddenly remembers the fighting technique that Hyunsook taught her. After finishing off Unji, Min Jong helped Hyunsook to kill the zombie that was holding him down. They then made their way to the office, but just as they were about to call for help, they realized there was no signal on their phones, and even the landline didn't work. Knowing that waiting for rescue was no longer an option, Hyunsook decided they had to find a way to escape on their own. Now that the mall is full of bloodthirsty and brutal zombies, they can only fight while looking for an exit. They finally managed to get rid of the zombies behind them with their coordination and flexible positioning. Hyunsook initially planned to go to the basement through the stairwell to find an exit, but they heard zombies approaching, so they returned to the ground floor's main hall. As they came out, the zombies outside noticed them. To protect Min Jong, Hyunsook locked her inside a car while he attempted to distract the zombies with a baseball bat. However, as more zombies gathered, the car was surrounded. In a moment of panic, Min Jong accidentally turned on the car's music, attracting all the zombies in the mall towards them. Hyunsook, who was fighting outside, was also crushed by the zombies. Just as Hyun Sook is about to be eaten by the zombies, Min Jong comes out of the car with a fire extinguisher. When the zombies smelled the fire extinguisher, they ran away like mice to cats. Hyun Sook was saved from the zombies by Min Jong. Hyun Sook and Min Jong then made their way to the underground parking lot. To their surprise, they encountered zombie Wang Nai again. Although the zombie Wang Nai has a strong body, it is never as flexible as a living person. <laughs> Hyunsook and Min Jong successfully coordinated their efforts to push Wang Nai to the ground. Hyunsook stepped forward, lifting his baseball bat and delivering a fierce blow to the zombie Wang Nai, finally killing him. However, before they could catch their breath, the now zombie Madamon suddenly crawled out from a corner. In an attempt to save Min Jong, Hyunsook was accidentally bitten by the zombie Madamon. In anger, Min Jong quickly dispatched the zombie Madamon with the baseball bat. Hyunsook, who was bitten, knew that he didn't have much time left and immediately said what he had buried in his heart. <laughs> After saying their final goodbyes, Hyunsook urged Min Jong to leave quickly from there, but just as Hyunsook and Min Jong took a couple of steps, they froze in place as a set of false teeth fell out from Hyunsook's pant leg. It turns out that Hyunsook was not bitten by Madame On, and even the socks on Hyunsook's feet did not have holes in them. The situation became quite awkward. In the end, Hyunsook managed to lead Min Jong to escape from the building. However, little did they know that not long after they left, Wang Nai, lying on the ground, suddenly sat up. This is the latest Korean movie released in 2023, Gangnam Zombie. If you enjoyed the story, you can watch the original film.